We are so excited to be at Los Abrigados Resort tonight for an event with this gentleman. Now, you know, they call Sinatra the chairman of the board, but in ILX world, this is the chairman of the board. Ladies and gentlemen, Joe Martori. Hey, Joe. Hey, good to see you, Glenn. Thank you. I'm a fan of your, your program. I watched uh, Nick Nolte's interview at least three times. <laughs> That's fantastic. Well, you're our, you're our Nick Nolte tonight. <laughs> Good. I went to nicknolte.com. And you did? Yes, and I know that it's a work in progress for you. Mm-hmm. I love your website, man. Yeah. And I, I'll tell you why. First of all, as soon as you open it up, <laughs> right? Can yeah. I talk about this? Yes, yeah, sure. All right. As soon as you open it up, you see two mug shots, right? Mm-hmm. One from your youth. Yes. And the other one, which we've all seen too many times. Yes, yes, yes. Right? Yes. Right. Yeah. I love that about you, man, because you own your life. You took, you own it. You don't, you don't, you don't skittle around. I give you a lot of credit for that, man. Well, that's the the, the truth of it is, is the experience you have in life is 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 what is vital. What I also love in your website too, because you know this man is so understated. It's not like you know big star website. Oh, look at me! These are all the things I've done. You share philosophies on your website. Yeah. I wrote a couple down, if I may share them sure. with you. One of them is, of course, about being in the moment, which you discussed. Our show is called Sedona Now because our philosophy is very important about being in the moment. That was one of the reasons we relocated to Sedona, Arizona. Yeah. Because here, it helps you to Absolutely. live in the moment with this much beauty in nature. How you, you can't forget yeah. of what's going on right now. I don't know who wrote the quote, but you share yeah. this in your website. I live, touch, and express each moment as though it were the only piece of time which has ever existed. Absolutely. Now, why do you feel that's an important, it's an important message to send to your fans? Because it's saying that we have to be aware. We're here with Mary Stewart Masterson. Hi, Mary. Hi. It's so good to have you here in Sedona. Thank you. It's great to be here. Of course, from Fried Green Tomatoes and many other Hollywood hits. And tonight, the film is Whiskey School. Yes, my father directed it. Let's talk about the book a little bit because I know you, you've done so much for education and we very much appreciate that. Not a lot of politicians do that because kids don't vote. Mm-hmm. So I think it's very important that you take a stand on that. This is something you do every year. Right. Uh, we started off giving a book to every first grader. We're so excited to have 3TV here in town. The number one morning show for the last 14 years. Good morning, Arizona. And we're going to be interviewing the cast and all the folks that are on the show today. So we're so excited to be standing with Tara Hitchcock. Glenn Scarpelli from Sedona now. Tara Hitchcock, good morning, Arizona. (laughs) I swear, if, if we came up here and you guys didn't show up, I was going to leave heartbroken. So I'm sure a lot of folks that come on your trolley ask why the Red Rocks are red. Do you have that answer for us, Armour? Well, Glenn, the reason the rocks are so red here in Sedona is that the sandstone has a very high iron content. We are so excited to be celebrating in the arrival of a 4,500-pound rhinoceros here at the Out of Africa Park, Camp Verde, Arizona, right outside of Sedona. What I do know about the addition to Boom Boom is that Boom Boom's life was basically saved by being transported to the Out of Africa Park. Am I correct? That's correct, Glenn. It's time for some holiday fun, Sedona style, here at the annual holiday tree lighting celebration in Uptown Sedona. We're gonna be talking to the mayor who's actually gonna be flipping the switch. We got Santa, we have carolers. It's a very magical day and we've bumped into the Winter Queen. Hello, Winter Queen. Hello, great to see you. You know, I'm short to begin with. Okay, I'm just gonna put that on the record. I'm short to begin with, but today I feel really short, so I needed some assistance. We're so excited to be talking to jazz legend Billy Mitchell. How are you, brother? I'm fine. I'm fine. It's really good to be here. Is it, man? How are you yeah. enjoying Sedona? It's wonderful. It's wonderful. I've been here many times. You know, they say that it's scientifically proven that if children have music in their life, they excel in their other schoolwork. Well, you know, that's what has uh, baffled me. So when we see you up there at your piano, I mean, it's like an extension of who you are, right? I mean, that's how I feel when you're playing. It's like, I don't know how he does it. I don't know how he, can, I don't know how he does it. It's just another part of him. Let me ask you, as a child, right, being one of those students at, at one point, when did you realize your love for jazz and, and, and piano? Well, you know, I did a workshop with the young, youngsters yesterday. This event really proves that Talakapaki is a destination in Northern Arizona for art. And we very much appreciate you being here tonight. All right, we'll catch you in a little bit.